Yeah, I was uh, actually quite happy. Uh, as you know, we're a relatively inexperienced group here through the first game. We played some young guys without a lot of game experience, uh, but I thought they settled in and, and played very well. We did have a hiccup early where Mox uh, let Eugene Lewis get behind him. Kobe had the PI, but after that we did settle in. I thought we played tremendous in the second half, well enough for us to be able to, to come back and win. Some new faces in this group, now some injuries. How do you make sure that the group stays focused and keeps improving? I really love the room. The room's got a lot of character. It's got a lot of integrity in it. The kids are dialed in, and uh, they are just that. They're kids. We're, we're going to play four guys with very, very limited game experience here in the CFL. Um, but the vets are in there. They're helping them out. They're communicating with them, talking them through things, uh, and there's just a lot of focus in the room. So I'm actually excited to see what this group's going to do against a very good uh, Hamilton receiving course Saturday night. Tremaine Washington was added to the mix this week. Do you see him playing a significant role on the team? Uh, yeah, a significant role in the team potentially in the future. I don't know what his status will be this week. I think we'll make that decision here very shortly in terms of what we're going to do, um, filling out the uh, filling out the extra roster spot from a defensive back standpoint. Uh, but he's got 10 interceptions in the last three years, so he's productive. He is a bit of a ball hawk, so I'd love to be able to see what he can do for us. Hamilton only had 13 points in their first game. They're probably going to be hungry to improve that defense, score a little bit more. How do you prepare for a team like that? Yeah, that's kind of the message that we hammered home repeatedly here throughout the course of the week. Uh, you know, we saw an offense that maybe struggled a little bit more than, than you would have expected on film there. That's not the group we expect to get Saturday night. It's their, it's their home opener. Uh, they're back-to-back -back, uh, Grey Cup participants, so we're going to get the best of the Ticats offense, so hopefully we're ready for it. Perfect. Thank you. Good Thank luck. You.